Welcome back. This is uh, Yam Jack. Today we got Commando Level One. You are here to clean out Zed. Suicidal and here comes Corridor. We're gonna be doing some more Commando here. I want to do some uh, minigun kind of stuff. I love the minigun, and I just I want to play it a little bit more. So that's what we're gonna do today. Now we, we're only level one, so it's it's you know not super super great. That's why I'm on Corridor instead of Verticality. Um, Verticality is a little bit too short for us to have enough space to kind of back up and reload if we uh, if we ever have to have that happen. But um, regardless, I, I I do like the mini guns. We're gonna be giving it a try here anyway. I don't know if it's gonna be successful or not, but we'll give it a try, right? I like Commander though. I like the mini gun. It's fun. I like Corridor as well. It's also a fun map. Man, not having much ammo capacity is kind of brutal, dude. Level 1 Commando. It's no good. We're not going to get any levels from this anyway, because... Um, cheats are enabled. I guess I... Could have not enabled cheats, but... Like... No. <laughs> no. I want my cheats. Dang it. I don't want to walk all the way back there. You, you kidding me? Absolutely not. Only as sharpshooter will I uh, will I not enable cheats. Because with sharpshooter, I just sit back there and pop them all as they walk towards me. It's good fun, but... Oh, man. When we were, when we were level 25, we never got the... Dang, well, we didn't get them off in. The dang quarter pounds on, uh, on round two. Level one, and they're like, "Oh, hey, we're gonna send like uh, all of the quarter pounds at you immediately," and uh, super, 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 super dangerous, honestly. So we're probably gonna die, honestly. Yeah. Um. So it really just boils down to whether or not we get the quarter pounds on round two, whether or not we'll be able to win. We'll give it another try. We'll give it another try. I'm not expecting a win, but I do want to play with the thing a little bit at least you know this is actually real you do get those items you do actually get the items you don't get the the, the boss you don't get the levels but you do get the items the items are uh, are definitely real I might make a, uh, a script cuz I don't know maybe there's some cool Halloween stuff to get I make a script that just runs into a game suicides and then leaves and keeps repeating over and over and over again. Let's leave it running overnight or something like that. Just so that uh, I can farm up a whole bunch of those Halloween tickets to get some Halloween items. I don't know what kinds of stuff we got in the Halloween thing. If there's cool stuff that I want, like a, a nice cool Halloween dress or something, uh, I might do that. If there's nothing cool in it, I think I am going to not enable cheese on this one just so we do get some, some actual money. Uh, if there's nothing cool in it, then like I'm not going to but, you know, let's, let's look right now. You're not going to be coming with me. Actually, no, you can come with me, because I can... I got Google Chrome open. Now, so we're going to go ahead and do Killing Floor 2 Halloween 2020 Cosmetics. Okay? Here, this, this album will do the job just fine. Got anything super cool in here? We're going to just kind of... Zoom on through. A couple of cool things, sort of. And then just guns. The guns look okay. I mean... They look fine. Out of, out of all this stuff, is there anything that I'd actually want to wear? If I could get this without the mask thing, then like, maybe... The glasses, maybe. The horns, maybe. But like all these Jaeger skins I don't care about. And the vault stuff I don't really care about. Yeah, probably uh probably a uh a no go on that front for me. None of that stuff really seems that interesting to me. There's some cool like Halloween dresses and stuff, then like sign me up, but like there there's there's really just nothing there that's uh that really catches my eye. I don't really care about weapon skins all that much to begin with. I have bought some, um, cause like you know, go on the Steam work, the Steam uh, uh, trading thing, and it's like you know, ten cents for a 
for gun skin or whatever, and I'm like, yeah, sure, why not, right? Like, give me one good reason why I wouldn't want to pick up uh, a sweet set for back when I was medic main. Um, you know, a sweet set for the medic, and then uh, I haven't done the same thing for gunslinger because prestige skins, dude. Um, so, but I mean, uh, you know, it's it's fine. It's fine. We're just not going to be farming up a whole bunch of tickets and, and getting a bunch of crates and stuff, which is fine. I'm a little bit, not annoyed, but disappointed, I suppose, about uh, the lack of cool skins. Because it would have been cool if there were some cool skins, you know? Some cool stuff. Unfortunately, it's a bit of a disappointment. But, you know, what can you do? What can you do? Just be disappointed is really it really all you got to do so I don't like making these things shocked like the other uh, stalkers also like dude we might die to an Edar just just picking us off from way down the line that's that's kind of annoying this is also like the worst possible time to be getting quarter pound spawning cuz uh, big oof dude big oof Big, big goof, yeah. Um, so, <laughs> I don't know if Commando with the AR-15 is really going to be able to handle two quarter pound spawns on wave two. If not for the quarter pound spawns, we can make it work. That was even worse, though. That was even worse. <laughs> we'll give it another try. I'm committed. I'm committed. I mean, we'll get levels eventually, right? Eventually, we'll be high enough level that uh, we don't have to worry about it. I haven't played SWAT in a while. Used to main SWAT for a bit. We did uh, we did a lot of SWAT for a while there. I like SWAT. It's fun. Ooh. Ah. What is that from? I feel like I recognize that. Is that uh, Kill La Kill? I don't know, man. I feel like I recognize it from somewhere, though. Streaming, uh, well, an hour and 45 minutes here. We're going to be doing some RuneScape, some Iron Man content. I'm excited about that. We've been getting some good stuff done on the Iron Man. Last week we got, uh, finally, the level 75 weapons. We only have, like, level 45, 50 stats. So, not a whole lot of use to us yet, but we're climbing. We're making progress. It feels good. Oh, crap. Actually, I have to uh, I have to play some RuneScape before stream because I have a uh, to get my Reaper assignment done. So I still have yesterday's Reaper. I have to have to finish that so I get uh, today's Reaper before the reset. That's gonna be a, a hassle. I might just skip it. <laughs> I don't really want to though because it's like valuable to do it, you know. But I don't know, man. Um. Look, it didn't. It has. It hasn't worked two times in a row. What are the chances that it doesn't work for a third time in a row? Pretty good. Yeah, yeah, pretty good. But Yolo, man, Yolo. I'm gonna give it a try. I'm gonna give it my best shot. Okay. Cause I want this to work. Unless we uh, unless we keep the AR-15, we can't afford the minigun by wave three, generally speaking, anyway. And I want to afford the minigun by wave three because I want to do wave uh, three and wave four and the boss wave with the minigun. That's that's how I have the most fun personally, is by using the minigun for as long as possible. And if I have just a little bit more damage from from some perk levels and a little bit of uh, you know abilities and, and skills and stuff from the the extra stuff you get from levels, you know, it'd be pretty doable. Ammunition would be a big one. Just just having bigger clips is bigger magazines. Big mags is, uh, is very important. But what's also pretty important is just getting lucky. And uh, 
not getting a quarter pound spawn. Which it seems like we've done. I believe all the uh, the Zeds should be spawned by now. There's only eight remaining, and I think we see, what, six on screen right now? We've got five on screen, and we only have five left. That's pretty good, dude. We made it. We made it. From this point onwards, the world is our oyster. I really don't understand the world is your oyster. I don't think many people do. I think I think it's uh, an idiom that's a lot of... Is it an idiom? Is that what it's called? I, th I think it's a, a whatever it is that uh, a lot of people have trouble with. Oh, what's that the other one? Um... Cause like, what? What do you mean? <laughs> the world is your oyster. What, what do you? What do you? What do you mean? I. I don't. I don't get it. I don't get it, dude. All right. Now you know. You know the way that this works is you. You hold down the right mouse button, and you put up with the. And it's really, really fun. And like I said, very, very fun. No ammunition in this, really, though. You know, the, the no, got small mags. It's the opposite of big mags. It's small mags. And uh, and slow reload. <laughs> so it's like uh, a, a two further, you know. But we can we can push stuff back pretty pretty gosh darn well with this, honestly. Which is uh, is good. I think I heard a uh, scrape or a quarter pound spawning. Sounds like a scrape, I guess. Another one? Might be flesh pounds, actually. Yes, flesh pounds. Oh, yeah. That's what I like to see. Oh, I love the minigun, man. It's such a satisfying weapon. This is like a really bad situation. This is a lot of visibility that we're losing. I don't like the bloat standing in my way, dude. You get like a, a wall of bloats coming your way and it's just like... You can't see nothing, dude. Is there, is there a flesh pound behind him? You'll never know. Uh, aisle one, actually. There's only one aisle. Suits and boots, guys. We've got something. I want to explode you. Thank you. Alright. Alright. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> Having fun, finally. I didn't know if we'd even be able to make it to the... Uh, uh, tactical reload. Yes. Probably, right? Like, that's probably the right thing to have. I don't know, dude. It's prop tactical reload is like reloading faster is probably better than an extra forty five bullets. I'm guessing. Um, but I don't I don't know. What I know is I really want that hundred percent extra magazine capacity because that is really really good. That's where stuff really starts to pop. You can't move like at all when you're firing either. We should be able to reload uh, at a decent speed now. Oh yeah, look at that reload speed, dude. I, I let go of uh, right mouse button instead of left mouse button there. <laughs> not, not quite the right way to do that. Man, the minigun is a satisfying gun, though. It's so weird because like you have like no ability to move while you're firing. And then you uh you all of a sudden have all of the ability to, to to like move your mouse. And it just it speeds up and it's very jarring when it happens, honestly. Cause you're like adjusting um for recoil and stuff like that, right? Because like I'm doing a lot to adjust for recoil right now. I don't know if you guys can, can notice it so much. So I'm doing a pretty good job of it. For the most part but um 
it's 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 it, there's a lot of recoil on this thing. It's not even like a lot of recoil per shot. Actually, it kind of is, but there are there are just a lot of shots. Like if I just fire, that's 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 what the recoil looks like, you know. So I'm uh, I'm pulling down at about you know opposite that rate to keep it looking more or less straight as we kind of fire. But even then, it's 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 kind of tricksy. Um, And then uh, you get you let go of the the mouse button, and all of a sudden you you have all of your control back, and it's like, well, I guess uh, we're firing at a normal rate now. Okay, we have to switch over to this and please make it. Ooh <laughs> I wasn't confident. I was not confident in that one. We're not skipping. I need to I need to heal as much as it'll let me. Okay. You know what? I'm skipping. I don't want to wait, man. I don't want to wait. I have no patience. We're not doing another run after this, by the way. This is going to be a, it's going to be a shorter episode, but like I'll be honest with you, what what's going to happen if we if we do another one is like we're just going to spend like eight minutes dying to to wave two quarter pounds probably. Um, so this is this is what we'll leave it at. We'll just leave it here. You got a minigun. I got a minigun. Yeah, we're just we're probably gonna die on this, right? Somehow we didn't, but we're not. It's not over yet. Yeah, yeah. If we had more bullets and more damage, he would have been yellow in the one burst. But you know, what can you do, right? What can you do? We did come so close to victory. He's right. We came so close, yet so dead. Lots of headshots, because uh, the minigun doesn't do a lot of damage per shot. It's just a ton of shots, especially since we're low level. Anyway, that's going to do it for today. So thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it. Subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.